To do a skull crusher with a cable machine, you're going to use the rope attachment and the pulley will be set at the lowest position. <clears throat> I have my bench with the head set up close to the rope. I'm going to lay down on the bench and you can choose what to do with your feet. If you feel stressed in your lower back, keep your feet positioned on top of the bench. Otherwise, if your lower back is comfortable, then you can ground your feet. This way I feel better anchored, so I'm going to demonstrate um, with my feet on the ground. Take hold of the, the rope attachment with the pinky side of your hand at the end of the rope. Next, pull your arms so that your upper arms are perpendicular to the floor. So I'm going to keep my elbows stacked over top of my shoulders throughout this entire exercise. Extend your arms. My full arm is now perpendicular to the floor and then lower the rope back over my head. Throughout this entire exercise, you will not have any movement in your shoulder at all. The only movement is happening in my elbow and as a little bonus here, I'm flaring the rope out at the top to get an extra big squeeze on my tricep. If you're getting tired, you might only be able to handle a straight push and that's fine, provided that you're not rotating with your shoulders. Okay, this way is a cheater and you can build up momentum and assist your, your triceps in getting the rope fully extended. So we want to keep all of the focus on the triceps and leave your shoulders out of it.